quadrant will pretty much operate on a proof of authority consensus mechanism and um, will handle more transactions, will operate at a lower gas price and it will achieve faster transactions and restrict malicious nodes from entering data. And an external proof of work chain will be used as an anchor for security purposes. Therefore, there will be two coins uh, used, the uh, E quadrant, E quad and quad. So there will be two, uh, two coins. Quadrant is pretty much designed to work with both centralized and decentralized services. The architecture consists of the core quadrant blockchain, clients, which can be data producers, data consumers and anchors, and guardian nodes. Quadrant will operate on a proof of authority consensus mechanism so that it can handle more transactions, operate at a lower gas price and achieve faster transactions and restrict malicious nodes from entering data into the network. And um, for the time being, guys, the Ethereum blockchain will be used for anchoring, but it can be replaced by, by any public chain in the future if uh, it's needed. So there are, there are a few problems that um, the people behind the project see in the data economy. For example, the A AI data gap. Small companies struggle to create AI innovations because they lack access to volumes of data their algorithms need. The unauthentic data, the data, uh, the data small companies do have access to produces poor algorithm results due to its questionable authenticity and unsustainable ecosystem. The data producers lack the incentives to provide the volumes of authenticity data required because they only get compensated for their initial sale. So uh, when it comes about um, their profile on ICO Bench, they got a 3.9 uh, rating. On uh, when on uh, their white paper, we see some more information regarding regarding the her token sale, the public sale, and uh, the the start of the public sale and the end of the public sale are to be determined. Will be announced in the future. The project has a hard cap of 20 million dollars and a soft cap of 3 million dollars. They accept Ethereum. Yeah, in order for uh, equal uh, tokens and with uh, five cents you can buy one equal token um, yeah pretty much there are a few restrictions as you can see to United States Canada New Zealand uh, Chinese and other people from the Republic of Korea they cannot participate um, and you need to pass the new customer verification process before you can participate in the sale guys the unsold equal tokens uh, will be held in a reserve for a future token sale to be held no sooner than two years after the close of the public sale and there is a total supply of 1 billion equal tokens guys 40% are going to go to the crowd sale 20% will be held by the company 20% by the stakeholders 10% for the reserves and 10% for the team that's very good. This is the team guys behind the project and also the advisors. They also have some data providers they work with and they have some partners and supporters of the project. If you wish to find out more about the project, the Quadrant Protocol guys, I'm going to leave a link in the description. Make sure to check it out. Do your own research, do your own due diligence and uh, make sure to um, decide by yourself if you wish to participate or not in uh, in this cell thank you for watching